Hey, what's up, man? It's your boy, Soldier Boy. You know, um, when it comes to birthday bash, you know, that's a very legendary event, you know, classic event, you know, it's annually. I mean, it's annual, you know. Um, and the first time I performed that birthday bash, you know what I'm saying? That was groundbreaking, you feel me? And it was a whole lot of people in the audience, you know what I'm saying? It had to be, like, one of the biggest shows I ever did, you know what I'm saying? And, and, you know, it was in my city, you know what I'm saying? So everybody was showing love. But um, other than that, man, you know, when Jeezy brought out um Kanye, that was real dope. You know what I'm saying? Um, the second year I performed, you know what I'm saying? The just really every year, you know what I'm saying? It mostly everybody in the ATL who everybody feeling gonna be at birthday bash. You know what I'm saying? So if you ain't at birthday bash, like and you and you a rapper in the A, then you know what I'm saying? I don't know. You may need to switch it up, but you know what I'm saying? Shouts out to birthday bash, man. You know, continue success each year. You know, straight from your boy Soldier Boy, we gon' rock. Man, when they came on TV, I was asleep. You know what I'm saying? I was on the road doing the show, man. I think I was in New York. And then my homeboys were calling my phone. They was blowing my phone up. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people were calling my phone. Like, and I woke up the next morning to like a hundred missed calls and texts, and they're like, man, he was on the boondocks and all that. So I didn't know nothing about it until it aired on TV. You know what I'm saying? After I saw it, I thought it was hilarious. Yeah, man, you know what? Um, my imprint, SODMG, man, we just trying to be the face of, you know, the new sound for hip music, you know. And I just want to give a big shout out to Sylvia Ron for believing in my company, you know, um, putting the money in my artists, you know, believing in my intuition, you know what I'm saying. So with my artist, Jabbar, he the first major artist, you know what I'm saying, besides myself off of SOD. And he got his single days right now, just killing the radio and the streets. And he just dropped this video on 106 and Park. So, you know, from the future, you'll be seeing a lot coming from my label. On oh my, man, I mean, right now, man, it's really only majorly is just me and Jabbar. You know what I'm saying? Major artists. And, and yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm looking for talent. You know what I'm saying? Most of my other art, SOD artists, they working their way up. You know what I'm saying? They on the come up. They in the stage that I was on early on. But, you know, later on, everybody going to rock. So. You know, shouts out to a successful business. Um, this album right here is called Dre D R E. You know, it draws July twenty eighth. It's my third major release from a, a, a major label. Um, you know, it's gonna have hit after hit on the album. You know, um, my beats then got better. You know, what I'm saying my flow, my lyrics delivery, all that. You know, what I'm saying my production skill, and I work from like. Really, you know what I'm saying? Whatever artist you can name in the game that's hot, I work with them. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, as far as producers, go the same thing. And I don't really go by name because I make all my own beats anyway. So, but, um, you know, to all my all my fans, you know, all the million people that bought my first album and all the millions that support it, you won't be disappointed with this album. The book is called Teenage Millionaire. You know what I'm saying? And um, basically the drive for it was like, you know, um, me making my first million dollars at 16 years old, and you know what I'm saying, coming straight from the hood, from nothing to something, you know what I'm saying, not know, not owing anybody nothing, just doing that all myself, you know what I'm saying, and it's just really basically, you know what I'm saying, just the info on my young fans, you know what I'm saying, was out here in the world, because when I was in the hood, I ain't know that it could go this far, you know what I'm saying, I ain't know the world was this big, you know what I'm saying, I just thought it was my block, you know what I'm saying, my hood, the stove, you know what I'm saying, school, you feel me? And now, you know what I'm saying, I'm, I'm 19 now. I done been, you know, all across the world, you know, from Japan, you know what I'm saying, from my hood, to probably your hood, you know what I'm saying? So it just really just to let, it just to inform people, that's all. Yeah, man, definitely, you know, when I tour overseas for the, a couple months, I was um, experiment, experimenting with a lot of different uh, types of music. When I was over in Paris, I had made a couple songs for uh, just my Paris fans that I didn't release in the United States. And, you know, it sound good. So just traveling all across the world, seeing um, so many things, it, it will change your view. Like, it'll, it'll give you more to talk about, you know what I'm saying? And it'll just make you want to just let somebody else, you know, see your vision through your eyes, if that makes sense. Yeah, man, I got a mixtape with um, DJ Drummer coming out. We already did the Follow Me, you know what I'm saying, the Gangsta Grizz. We got the part two of the Gangsta Grizz. When, as far as it comes to music, man, I listen to everybody, you know what I'm saying? Like, I really just be focusing on myself, you know what I'm saying? Like, these days, my number one, like, I'm my, I'm, my, I'm my number one fan, you know what I'm saying? All I got is my music, you know, because I'm so focused. But, you know, people who inspire me to do what I'm doing, I got to give props to the CEO, baby. 
you know what I'm saying, a Cash Money Records. He an OG in the game, you know what I'm saying, made millions and millions of dollars. And when I met up with him, you know what I'm saying, on my path, he chopped it up with me like a real dude and kept it 100. And you know what I'm saying, that's one of the dudes who I put first, you know what I'm saying, because he really showed the blueprint. You know what I'm saying, secondly, Master P, you know what I'm saying, he's from the South. Well, with, with how I'm doing SOD Money Gang and everything, he had no limit going real crazy when he was out. And that's another dude that I salute. You know what I'm saying? Um, of course, you got to say Diddy. You know, he been in the game for a long time. You know what I'm saying? He showed, he was another person to show to everybody, you know what I'm saying, that it's possible to make that type of money and to be successful and, you know, to support and create jobs for people, you know what I'm saying, who need it. So, um, you know, them three, you know what I'm saying? But shouts out to uh, Birdman.